Hey, my name is Jenny Allen, and I'm an author and the leader of If Gathering. And today we're looking at Romans 15, 5, and it says, May the God who gives endurance and encouragement give you the same attitude of mind toward each other that Christ Jesus had. Now, if you go and look in the context of this chapter, you'll see later that the attitude that Jesus had is that of a servant towards each other, which, guys, we are so far from that right now in our world. In our house, we call this not being a brat. <laughs> That's what we say. We were like, you're being a brat. I mean, we just will say it because, honestly, there is a lot of brattiness happening in the world right now, if I'm just being really candid. And, and what Scripture is calling us to, what Christ intended for us, is that we would honor one another, that we would defer to one another, that we would, it says in the scripture further on down in 15, it says that we would accept one another, that there would be an acceptance, a mutual love, affection, acceptance for each other. Now that does not mean that we constantly approve of every other person's opinion, but guys, disagreeing with other others' opinions, that's part of living, right? That's always been here. It feels exasperated right now, but the reality is these verses apply today, that we can serve one another and love, defer to one another, that we can have the mind of Christ toward each other. It is a wholly different way to view each other. And I know that it's difficult, and I know that that feels impossible with some people in your life. But I think God wrote these verses for the impossible relationships in our lives. He didn't write it for the times that it's easy to do that. He wrote us to call us to more, and, and that means it's possible.